from Michigan Stadium in Ann Arbor, on TV Sports presents college football action as the Michigan State Spartans take on the Michigan Wolverines. Michigan State won the toss and has elected to receive. Otis Grant, number nine, goes deep. Bruce Reeves is back there with him, as is number 27, defensive back Thomas Morris. And there's Ali Haji Sheik's kickoff sailing deep and through the end zone. No chance for a return. Decided we'll kick it off to them and take the win, and I think they might have done that had they won the toss anyway because there is a strong breeze. Offensive line for Michigan State with a few adjustments, so although Jones, Kimichek, and Tony Gilbert are the receivers, John Leister, the sophomore quarterback from Great Falls, Montana. Long count for Leister as he looks over the Michigan defense and throws to the wing. Steve Smith can't hang on. Incomplete hitter. Although judging from play number one, it appears that Muddy Waters plans to try to pass against them. The Michigan defense, linebackers, Andy Canavino. A standout back there, and Marion Body, Carpenter, Jackson, and Reeves. The fullback is Andy Schramm, and he goes in motion. Pitches to Smith. A little opening. Steve Smith gets seven yards. Third and three, Michigan State, 27-yard line. Schramm is up close behind Leister. Leister, Leister gives the Smith all down. He is wrapped up, but he fell down. Just the man Michigan wants to receive a punt. A low punt that should take a good bounce at the Michigan 40-yard line. Not that good. Goes out of bounds. 38. Well, has uh, hurt them in the sense that Thackowitz didn't get the good kickoff, and the Wolverines start with their offense uh, in good field position. The receivers, Betts Mitchell and a Anthony Carter, and the offensive backs with John Wangler starting at quarterback today. That'll be the second straight game. Michigan State has chosen to start a couple of seniors in that defensive backfield, notably Mike Marshall out of Detroit Southwestern. And off to Ricks. Big opening. Lawrence Ricks. Second and one for Michigan. There's an illegal procedure. Illegal procedure, Michigan State. <laughs> First and ten, Michigan. Michigan State 47-yard line. And Wangler looks for Alan Mitchell. Oh, that's incomplete. It was picked up. Wangler had enough time to get him free. So we take a look at the Michigan State defense that has been running quite a bit this year. Although there are some replacements in there already because of some injured players. Last week's contest against Notre Dame. Second and ten, Michigan. Wangler has Edwards and Ricks, and he gives the Ricks, and Ricks goes right down. Big hit by Johnny Lee Hain. Most people would expect pass in a situation like this. And Wangler gives them what they would expect. Over the middle, Anthony Carter dropped it. He was open. Kick away from about the 40-yard line for Bracken. Heading for the far sideline. Good bounce. Morris grabs it at the 7-yard line and is buried. Michigan State was unable to move the football, so let's pick up the action later in the quarter. First down, Michigan. Edwards, straight up the middle. Pops off a tackle. First and 10, 15, 16 yard line of Michigan State. Michigan on the move. Lawrence Ricks, no room to run this time. And he is set back by John McCormick. All right, both receivers now on the left side for Michigan. Carter in the slot. Mitchell out. Ricks gets the handoff straight ahead. Near at the 10 yard line before he is met. Third down and four. Yes, that is a hole in Larry Rick's pants. Steve Edwards straight ahead. They'll mark it at the 15-yard line, a 25-yard field goal, and that's what Michigan's going to do on fourth down and one. It is. Sheets kick is up and good. And Michigan gets on the scoreboard first. A field goal of 25 yards. It's the Wolverines three and the Spartans nothing. Not much wind at all right now as Sheik sends another one all the way to the back of the end zone and Grant says no. Leister has Tony Ellis now at fullback along with Steve Smith but it's a pass over the middle, batted in the air and intercepted by Miriam Body at the 30-yard line. Body knocked out of bounds. 23-yard line. Good quick reaction by Andy Canavino. First down, Michigan at the 23-yard line of state. Wangler to Carter. That's the one-yard line or more. Going to be the one-yard line. Anthony Carter very close to being in. Got two tight ends in the offense. Benson Dunaway. Michigan State gathered in about a nine-man line. Lawrence Ricks. Touchdown. 
down. Hewlett sets it. It is good. And 10 it is. Michigan leading Michigan State 10 nothing with 442 left in the first quarter. This one is also deep in the end zone. No return. First and 10 Michigan State at the Rick scoring from a yard out. Michigan State's turn again. First down at their own 20. Leister rolling right. Gonna run, but nowhere to go. He just gets back to the line of scrimmage. He's gonna have a little trouble scrambling on him because he's been tough all year. Second and 10. Leister fakes Thompson. Cuts back inside, but only gets a yard or two. Steve Smith, the running back. Leister on a third and seven, drops straight back, lobs one deep, got his man, Otis Grant, out of bounds in Michigan territory. That's a Spartan first down. Michigan State first down. 32 yards on the play, first down at the Michigan 45-yard line. Second and six, Daryl Turner, the freshman from Flint Southwestern, splits out to the right. He's number 38. Give it to Smith. Smith finds very little running room, but third down at about three. That. No, probably not. Leister straight back to throw. It's a little time. Runs out of the hole. Thompson is after him, but Leister dives ahead and is very close. Andy Schramm is the lone back behind Leister. Leister. Looking to throw down the middle. Knocked down. Andy Canavino got a hand on that. Second and 10. Michigan 35-yard line. Leister. Looking to throw or run, whatever he can find. A little room to run. Good balance. Got third down and two. Leister moving his men around. Somebody's out of position. The clock is going against him now, but they get the snap off. Steve Smith gets the first down around left end. Thrown out of bounds at the 20. Now it's back to the 43-yard line of Michigan. Steve Smith again split wide right this time. Screen pass. They get away. Tony Ellis got some room. Cracks up near the 30-yard line. Leister is the holder. No. Yeah. Kick is up. Long enough. And good. Horton Anderson hits from 49 yards out. And Michigan State has scored three points. Michigan still leads, however, 10-3. Three seconds remain in the first quarter, and the clock won't start till they snap the ball, so Michigan will have to run at least one more play. Wangler with Edwards and Ricks behind him. Ricks it is. Runs right into Johnny Lee Haynes, bounces off for maybe a yard, and that's all as the first quarter ends with Michigan on top of Michigan State, 10-3. to three. Michigan was unable to move the football, so we pick up the action later in the quarter. Leister on the first and ten, rolls. Throws one deep, his man is open. Got it. Jones, fumbled ball, but no, it's, it's going to be a catch and a first down. And it looked to me like it was a fumble. I'll agree with you, Jim. First down. Grant fumbles. And Michigan covers that ball. A great chance for Michigan State. Gone by way of the fumble of Tony Ellis. Gerald Ingram gets the call. McAdoo in the middle of the piles. Second and eight. Wangler delivers the ball. First down. And Anthony makes the catch. First and ten. And the game is for Wolfo. And Wolfo gets some yardage. Uh, Marshall with his body and makes the catch. Second and one. Wangler going for more than a first down. Too far and out of bounds on this third and one. Wolfolk it is. Good move by Wolfolk. He runs into the official. First and ten Michigan at the Michigan State 48-yard line. It's Edwards straight ahead. He gets down to about the 45-yard line. Wolfolk and Edwards behind Wangler, Michigan State's linebacker. Bailey dropping in and out of it. Wolfolk tries the right side. Makes 
past his own running room before he's hauled down. Third down, two yards to go. Wolfolk again, looking for an opening. Very little. Like two tight ends now. Bunched in tight, and only Mitchell split left. And Wolfolk goes straight ahead. He got, I think, enough for the first down. Credit John Powers back in there again. Didn't make it. Michigan State held. A good charge, but let's pick up the action later in the quarter with Michigan State in possession. Second and 10, still at the 16. 5.25 left to play in the half. Otis Grant goes wide to the left. Leister back to throw. Over the middle, wide open is Jones. And that's good for about nine. Otis Grant split to the wide side. Leister tries a quarterback sneak for that first down, and I don't know. Fourth down and one. A bigger play than the third down play they converted. And they're going to go for it all. Leister rolling. Cuts inside. He's got the first down. He got the touchdown. He survived the hit at the three-yard line and got six. You don't see a quarterback take a hit like that and keep going. This kid, John Leister, now watch the left knee. Is it down? It was down, but the referee ruled that he got in. Martin Anderson has just converted. John Leister leads the Spartans back, and with 4-12 remaining in the half, it's all tied up at 10. On paper, Michigan is much the stronger team. On the scoreboard, it's equal. First and 10, throw is for Butch Wolfolk and complete. George Cooper, the linebacker, one of two, second and six. Wolfolk takes a pitch, runs straight on into 39, third down and two. Michigan at their own 28-yard line. Edwards, the deep back in this setup. Wangler to throw, however, on third and two. He's got running room on this side, but runs into his own man. 2.20 left in the half. First and 10 at the Michigan 30-yard line. Stanley Edwards is met at the line of scrimmage. And you were ready to write this one off at 10-0. I didn't say anything about writing it off. I saw that smile. Wangler in trouble. Gets it away. Complete Dunaway. Dunaway down the sideline with a blocker in front. Blake Marshall pushes him out at the 12-yard line. First and 10, Michigan at the Michigan State 13-yard line. Big play game. Wangler to Wolfolk. Cuts back. Runs into James Neely, the linebacker. Second down and eight. Wolfolk and Edwards behind Wangler. Wangler throwing for Carter. No good. Bounds as Anthony goes all the way into the stands. Third and nine. Maybe he didn't have possession of the ball at that point. That was blocked from us. Third and nine. Wangler again throws. Knocked down. Great defensive play. Cheek will try to put Michigan ahead. 19-yard line is the spot. 29 would be the field goal distance. It's up. And it's good. And Sheik hits on his second field goal of the afternoon. Michigan goes back in front of Michigan State. 13 to 10. Sheik is set to kick off for the Wolverines. Otis Grant is deep for the Spartans, and that kick will sail into the end zone. No, it bounces at the one-yard line and bounces through the end zone, That's so the fine. same result, but get the 29-yard field goal, and Michigan is on top, and Leister will try to cut back into it. Screen pass, complete to Ellis. Gets a block for 30, 35, and out of bounds at the 40. If you get inside to the Michigan territory, you're in scoring position with him. First down, open man, Ted Jones, complete and out of bounds at the Michigan 40-yard line. Who's given the Spartans another first down. Leister slips, but writes himself and throws deep. Out of bounds, coverage by Brian Carpenter. I think in a situation like this, though, that kind of pass is, you know, wise. Second and 10. Over the middle, Steve Smith takes the hit from Canavino, stays on his feet, but gets no yardage. Third down and 10, 40-yard line of Michigan. 16 seconds left in the half. Leister has some time. Over the middle. Incomplete. Almost intercepted by Marion Body. 
57 yards on the kick. Harry Oliver, I would believe. The kick is going. Good. Just cleared the bar into the wind. Incredible. Five seconds left on the clock. And Michigan State has tied Michigan 13-13. They'll go for the short kick and be sure they run out the clock and not give Carter a chance to do anything. Ball is under a pile up at the 34-yard line. They didn't run out the clock. Three seconds to go. Wangler, and I imagine you'd look for Carter. John is back. He looks for Carter. In and out of his hands, and the clock runs out. It's halftime in Ann Arbor with the score. Michigan 13, Michigan State 13. And this one proving you can throw out the record books when they play each other. Michigan against Michigan State, as much fun as you could ask for on a Saturday afternoon. Morton Anderson's kick is high and deep in the end zone, in fact, right through. After an exchange of punts, we pick up the action later in the quarter. 20-yard line of Michigan State, second down Michigan. Five to go for a first down. Stanley Edwards, right back to the line of scrimmage, and that's all. Otherwise, two tight ends. Two setbacks behind Wangler. Throwing play. Incomplete for Edwards. Field goal attempt for Haji Sheik. 26-yard line, a 36-yard kick if he can make it. Sheik has made a pair already today. And that's easily far enough and good enough. And Michigan, a penalty flag is down. Personal foul on the kicker. Roughing the kicker penalty against the Spartans has may cost them dearly with Thomas Morris. 27. Looks like the Spartans are going to come on this play. Wolfolk jumps back. He gets down near the five-yard line on this second down play. Wolfolk looking straight ahead. Gets a yard, maybe two. Got the penalty, gave him back a first down. And this is third down. Pitch for Anthony Carter in the corner. He got him. Touchdown. John Wangler, beautifully thrown pass. Very simple pass, too. A hold. Woo! Kick is good. With 4-11 left in the third quarter, Michigan has taken another lead over State. 28-13. On the next series of downs, Michigan State was forced to punt. So we move ahead to action later in the quarter. Now at the 17-yard line of the Wolverines, first down. Carter is out to the top of your screen. And Wangler is looking for it. And Barry, John is sacked. It's second down and 20, and in four field position, the Michigan 8-yard line. Wolfo in trouble, and he goes down at about the 6-yard line. And that's the end of the third quarter of play with the scoreboard reading Michigan 20, Michigan State 13. In the bottom corner, that's Alan Mitchell, number 30. And it's Wangler back to throw out of his own end zone. Carter fell down. Interception, Michigan State out of bounds at the 22-23 yard line. Senior Carl Williams from Big Break. First and 10, Michigan 22 yard line for Michigan State. Ellis and Smith. The running backs behind Leister, and Ellis jumps over a couple, gets to the 20-yard line. Second down play. The interception has given Michigan State a break. Got to capitalize. Leister runs an option, but doesn't get past Robert Thompson. Only four yards. Leister going to look to see if he can get the other six. Knocked down at the five-yard line. 20, 35-yard field goal attempt by Morton Anderson. He's got it. As you said, Jim, almost automatic from this deep, and the turnover results in three points for Michigan State and a 20-16 game, Michigan on top by four. Brockington is split left, and Anthony Carter is the flanker out to the right. Wangler's pitch to Wolfo. Hey, can't reach him. Wolfo gets a couple. These games are settled each year on the field. Throw out the records. Second down, Edwards through the middle. There's an opening. Stanley Edwards, hauled down by Carl Williams. 
First and 10, Michigan at the 49, a 25-yard burst for Stanley Edwards. Now Michigan with good field position, which Wolfolk is tripped up. Second and seven. Carter's out left, top of your screen. Edwards gets it, breaks through. Across the 40, 30-yard line. Edwards down the sidelines, pushed out by Neely, the linebacker. But it's first down and deep in Michigan State territory. And it's first and 10 at the Michigan State 24-yard line. Wofo gets the call, slips the tackle, breaks for the outside, gets by Marshall. There's another first down, and finally he is rolled out of bounds on the far side. Michigan was here once before in the third quarter and did not cash in. This time it's Edwards up to about the six yard line. And Anthony's in motion. Second and seven. Wofo gets the pitch and gets nailed for a loss of yardage. Third down and eight for Michigan at the Michigan State eight. Langler looks for someone to throw to. Over the middle. Yes. Got it tight end. Dunaway. Touchdown, Michigan. Everybody's looking at Anthony Carter and Alan Mitchell on the outside because that's where they go. And then tight end Craig Dunaway. Their big touchdown against Notre Dame earlier this year. Sheik's field extra point is good. And Michigan has taken a 27 to 16 lead over Michigan State with 10.45 to play. That's Ted Jones who is split out to the right and Tony Ellis the lone setback. He gets the call and gets maybe a yard. You won't find a coach that won't. No. Second and eight. Leister. Over the middle, open man. Bruce Reeves, if he can turn it up, he's got the first down, 40, 45 yard line before Reeves at the state, 46 yard line. Quick pass to the sideline. Jones with a great catch. Ted Jones, one handed, first and 10 at the Michigan 39 yard line. Michigan State on the move. Trying the left side. He cuts back and gets inside the 35. 9 18 left to play. 27 16 the score. On second down, passes behind Ellison incomplete. Sack would be considerably better. 50% completion average for Leister. He hits a big one to Jones again. First down at the Michigan 24 yard drop. Smith adjusts his position in the backfield. Ellis is the ball carrier. Runs through a couple of tackles to about the 21. Ellis and Smith shift. Meister looking for Jones. Wow to the end zone. Jones almost had it. For you. My body did not interfere with him. Third down and six to go. Over the middle. He got the first down. Michigan State at the Michigan 12-yard line with a first and 10. Great field position because he got a lot of downs to go for it. Ellis breaks through inside the five to the four. Michigan State threatening again. Ellis goes in for the touchdown. Michigan State has scored. Michigan State will go for one. Morton Anderson, sure fire. He is connected and missed only once on a bad snap from center in the Notre Dame game. He didn't get a chance to convert an extra point. He converts this one. It is Michigan 27, Michigan State 23 with seven minutes to play. The crowd comes to its feet. Kickoff is high, a lot of hang time, falling at about the four where Carter will get a chance to return it. Looking only to the 20-yard line, he stands up under a real solid hit. After an exchange of possessions, we pick up the action later in the quarter. A field goal attempt from the 22-yard line or an apparent field goal attempt. A 32-yarder, if good. Hewlett does not. He's rolling out. Hewlett on the action. Being chased and knocked out of bounds. He was chased out by George Cooper. Bo chose to gamble with the fake field goal, and it didn't work. It's first and 10. Yeah, Michigan State at their 19-yard line. Leister in trouble. Turgovac. He gets it away and almost completes it. <laughs> Second down and 10. Leister on the rollout. 
Third down and ten. Big play for the Spartans if they are to have any chance at all. Leister has some time. Incomplete. Intercepted Andy Canavino. Getting a tip from Nicolau. No, no, 94. James Herman. This is the second week in a row they've gotten up emotionally for a football game. Last week against Notre Dame, and then this week against Michigan. And it's a tough loss for Michigan State, but I'll tell you, they've proved that they are a good football team, and I think they'll be a factor in the Big Ten race. Congratulations, Jim. You won it today. <laughs> be sure to join us next week as the Michigan Wolverines travel to Minneapolis to take on the Minnesota Golden Gophers. Once again, the final score here today, Michigan 27, Michigan State 23.